What's up, everybody? High fuse and high all of our viewers. This is Big Fruit of the Queen Diva, your best of believer, and you are looking at some of the behind scenes of what it takes for me to get ready for one of my concerts. As you can tell, I'm a bald head queen right now, and this is not how I walk around the streets of New Orleans and nowhere else. I'm here today with Mike Shears, and he's about to slay this lace frontal and get this wig together. Yes. So y'all pay attention and learn something today. Girl down. Today we're going with a nice bob look today. And I'm going to be installing it on Frida. It's very quick and easy. This is the tape method that I like to do. I like to call it my 90% tape and my 10% glue. And I'm just going to pop it on like that. The tape does not curve to the actual lace. We're going to go in and seal it up with our um, lace glue. Her hair is protected underneath with the cap, and then we um, tape it down with the tape, and we're just going to seal it down with the glue. And no, so it's not Gorilla Glue. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here at least once or twice a week, depending on what type of performance I have, what type of events I have, how I want to change the wig. And another tactic that we do, we have to sew the back down. Yeah. Um, I shake a lot. I bend over. I <laughs> have my head swinging all kind of ways. Anything can happen. You have to have some security to your wigs, ladies. Right here, we're gonna uh, take the needle and stitch it through a braid. And it's going to basically serve as an anchor for her lace. As you can see right now, I'm pulling. See, all of you don't know what the Queen Diva goes through. Beauty is a process. It takes time and it takes patience. You lay, you lay, honey. All right, thank you, baby. So now we're gonna have Rhonda to step in and she's about to style this thing, honey. So today I am going to um, just give Frida a little bit of a movement with her hair. And I think I'm gonna also go in and just detail this cut that we we pre-cut the hair, but we're gonna detail it just a little bit more. I've been working with Rhonda for a very long time and Rhonda gave me all of my signature looks. So right now, I'm, what I'm doing, I'm kind of going in and kind of giving Frida a little, little bit of texture without taking away the length. It definitely doesn't grow back. So we put the movement and the texture in the hair. So when we start curling the hair, it's just gonna flow and fall effortlessly. I don't use a lot of sprays in my hair because I need to be able to do something with it myself on an everyday basis. And as you can see, I'm not really like giving the hair a lot of curls. I'm just really imprinting a curl pattern. It's looking good. All right, guys, so now you have solved it before. This is the app of the Queen Diva is ready now. Thanks for tuning in. This is Queen Diva, and I'm checking out. Girl down, you already know.